Hey, what's up everyone? This is Luke and welcome back to Luke I'm on TV. As I mentioned in my last video, my Nintendo Wii video game collection video, that I would probably be playing House of Dead Overkill for my next video. So this is it. And uh, I just hooked up my Wii for the first time in a long time yesterday. So I already went through all the Wii settings just to kind of make sure everything was right where I wanted it to be. And I also put new batteries into my Wii remote just to make sure it was going to be as accurate as possible. Um, before I play this game, I just want to give you a heads up that there is supposed to be a lot of foul language in this game. So if you don't care to hear a lot of foul language, you may not want to watch this video. And also, if there are any kids in the room, you might want to send them outside to go play or something. Uh, I also might be dropping a few F-bombs myself from time to time, so I'll just let you know right now about that. So anyway, without further ado, let's play House of the Dead Overkill. So right away I gotta say this is a pretty cool intro, it looks kinda like a 70s B movie or something. Got some really hot chicks dancing here. Yeah, I definitely dig it, it's pretty good. <laughs> yeah, that's a pretty good intro. I like that. All right, so I'm just going to go ahead and create a new profile here, it looks like. Um, well, I usually create the, uh, I usually use the name Dogtown when I create my new profiles. Uh, if you ever seen the movie Dogtown and Z-Boys, that's kind of where I got it from. It's a skateboarding documentary that I really like. Alright, so we're just going to go ahead and select that then. Uh, so right now it's a story mode, mini mode, uh, mini games. I'll go to options. Uh, I'll go to audio settings first. You can turn down the music, the sound. Of, you can turn the sound effects up. I usually turn the sound effects up. So, um, oh, let's try that again. Okay, I don't know what the deal is there. I'm trying to move that. Well, anyway, we'll just go ahead and I don't know what happened there. I was trying to move the dial up, but it didn't seem to work. Anyway, we'll go to player controls. I don't know. Right now, my I'm pretty happy with the way the settings are right now, so I'll just go with this for right now. I don't want to waste too much time here. Go back. Um, okay, yeah, it looks like okay, you know you play story mode right now. There's something that's uh it says coming soon. Yeah, I probably have to unlock that. Okay. 
What's up, motherfucker? They met as adversaries. What the fuck was that for? A monster made them allies. <laughs> a secret agent. Immaculate. Intelligent. A rookie. They call him only G. His identity? A mystery. You ever gonna tell me when what that fucking G stands for? No. A Playboy cop. Isaac Washington. Make him mad, and he'll rip your balls off. I'm gonna rip your motherfucking balls off. Tonight, these unlikely allies will confront terror most foul in the blood so tall. Papa's Palace of Pain. <laughs> Be I guess, a courteous guest. I definitely like the style of this game so far. It looks pretty cool. By tomorrow morning, I'll have my motherfucking revenge. Papa Caesar will be dead. If we don't stop this mutant outbreak by tomorrow morning, we'll all be dead. Because your first visit will be your last. Papa's Palace of Pain. Rated X. <laughs> Yeah, pretty good intro here. I like it. You can definitely tell the Wii graphics, though. You can tell they're pretty outdated. I don't... Shit, man. I think I slept at that thing. So right away, I can use the A button to reload, which is really nice. I kind of just jump right into the game here. It's all pretty fast paced. I don't know if you can hear this, I actually have sound coming out of my Wii remote. Looks like I slowed time down, it looks like. <laughs> That's a pretty cool effect. Kind of different. I'm trying to shoot these things, I, I don't know if they're just for points or if you get anything from that. Oh, uh, there's a health kit I see. I'm trying to hit that. I'm getting my ass kicked meanwhile. So far the graphics aren't too bad. I don't mind them so much. So far, it definitely lives up to the house of Denny so far. I think it's kind of happening really fast. I tried to shake the remote real quick to see if it would reload it again, so it looks like I have to hit the A button. Or maybe I could shoot off screen, I don't know. I'm not, well, uh, it doesn't seem to work. Oh. As you can tell, I'm not real great at these light gun games. 
I don't play them all the time or anything. Big fan of uh, Time Crisis, so I really like the Time Crisis series. I also like the game Ninja Assault on PS2, if you ever play that one, that's a pretty cool game, I like it. Some people give it a lot of shit because uh, they say that you play as like a ninja with a gun, but you can't let that mess you up. You're shooting ninjas in the, in the game, so, I mean, what's really cooler than that? These guys are pretty easy to shoot, they're all pretty slow moving and whatnot, and in Ninja Assault they're like throwing uh, shurikens at you and shit, pretty cool. I just shot his leg off. <laughs> oh, I gotta get, I gotta be quicker on the reload, man. I'm... Okay, so I'm also starting to notice I'm starting to like shoot the same people over and over. It's getting kind of uh, a little repetitive. I'm also getting kind of tired of this gun. I kind of wish I had like a shotgun or an Uzi or something. Okay, I'm trying to shoot that dude. For some reason, my controller went completely off the screen there for a minute. I don't know if it's meant to be that way or what, but I... Shit, man. That ain't right. Sure. But so far, I like it. So far, it's pretty fun. It's definitely a pretty good arcade-style uh, light gun game. Lives up to the house of their name so far. Yeah. Okay, I killed those guys. Oh, fuck. I'm kind of curious, like, how many continues I get in this game, too. I didn't seem to look that up or anything, so I don't know. If... Usually it depends on the difficulty setting, but I didn't see a difficulty setting. I didn't, I guess maybe, or maybe I get deep enough into the menu or something. I don't know, but uh, I didn't see a difficulty setting. How many times do I have to tell you not to use the Z word? Oh, once again, I gotta be quicker on the reload there. Oh my god. I'm kind of like hoping to shoot the crates. Maybe there'd be a gun in there or something, but it seemed to work. Seems like you got unlimited ammo in this game as well. Oh, I, I died. Okay, it says continue, but it doesn't tell me how many continues I have. Well, it looks like we made it through that section. Okay? No, I am not okay, asshole. Shake it off, detective. Come on, let's move. Some of the dialogue is a little cheesy, I admit. But again, if you think about like a like a B movie, they definitely have some cheesy dialogue and the acting is usually not very good. It's got a cool look to this game though. It'd probably be a lot of fun to play around Halloween. Oh my god. Things are starting to speed up a little bit here. Now I'm not really going to get my ass kicked. Oh my god, he came back. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm really getting sick of this handgun. I want a shotgun or something. Jesus. Maybe later in the game you get better guns or something. Oh, God. Who taught these guys table manners? Mother! These guys ain't humans! <laughs> I've never seen this kind of crazy shit before. Putting right, them so in like the wood chipper, kind of like in the movie Fargo. Subject, and I'll lead an interrogation. Fuck Keep that shooting that same fat guy. I'm getting me. sick of shooting that fat guy. And this, this fucker, too, he's relentless. He keeps coming after me. Fucking fat ass? 
kind of reminds me of the game Bioshock. I, I love that game, but it got, oh shit, it, it got kind of repetitive shooting the same like splicers over and over, and they're falling on the ceiling and all that. And I love the game; it's one of the, my favorite games. But it got it did get kind of repetitive like, like halfway through the game because they just kept shooting and killing the same people. But this time, these dudes in that fucking helmet, they're like, oh my god. So, he's kind of new. They just added him in there now, so. And they're gonna start adding different characters. A sadistic crime lord, master of a perverse science. My darling Jasper, do you have a present for me? They call him. Our test subject at the hospital is showing progress. You've done very well, my boy. We shall celebrate this tonight with takeout Chinese. A brilliant <laughs> mind. With this definitely kind of reminds mind. me of like one of those Halloween God movies you'd see, like Halloween God night at like 12, 30, 1 o'clock in the morning, His like on a USA channel or something. Evil to protect the sister who raised him. <laughs> You impotent cripple. <clears throat> Think of your sister before threatening Papa Caesar. Next time you speak, turn the volume to zero, fucking cabbage. <laughs> Nobody threatens Varla. The ultimate sacrifice. Freeze, bitches! <laughs> Oh my God. Because of the shocking nature of the following scenes, they are definitely not recommended for the squeamish or the easily offended. <laughs> okay. Okay, this looks like this might be a boss or something. Yeah, yeah, what it's like the boss here. Must be the boss at the end of the first level. I can't get a good shot. Okay, I, I, I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do here. I'm just gonna just fire away here. Not seeing, not doing any damage on this dude yet. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Oh shit! You are dead. Oh, he's like throwing shit at me. What? Oh. Oh. Shoot him. Oh. Okay, maybe I'm supposed to hit him now when he's got that circle thing going on. Once again, I wish I had a better gun. This handgun sucks. Oh shit! Feel like a fucking table at me. Oh, oh I did my ass kick up. Oh, I got, I got, oh, he's got more stuff. Okay. This guy keeps throwing that stuff. He's like a, like a decapitated mannequin at me. Definitely a very interesting boss. I've definitely never seen anything like this before. You're man, dead. man, I am not very good at this game. I gotta admit. Oh, here comes a trash can or a wheel can or whatever. Alright, now I gotta. I'm not gonna unload on him. He ain't got nothing on him now. Oh, he's got more stuff. Okay. I don't know what the secret is, but I'm sure there's some kind of secret. It's my first time playing it, so I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. I haven't even got him down to half damage yet. I've already died like twice. Oh my god. Okay. Oh! Man. Throw an arm, throws an arm at me. I still haven't gotten down to half damage yet. I don't know. That's when I, I think that's when I'm. Yeah, I think that's when he's most vulnerable, probably when he's got that circle thing. And then he does that little move, and that's when I know that he's throwing something at me, like that thing. Oh. 
Right away, this boss is pretty difficult. The first boss is taking a lot of shots here. I got him a little under half now. I just, just keep on loading, I guess. Like, oh. Okay. Now he's just gonna come after me now? He's got some big ass claws on him. I think I got him. I think I died like three times there. Some long loading in this game, I gotta say, but again, it is the Wii, so. Betrayed. Tell my sister I love her. Fuck! How do you say that shit without moving your lips? Gee, you see this shit? An act of mercy. It hurts so much. I can help you. Sounds like Chewbacca. No, you can't fucking not. Shoot the motherfucker. Don't you do tat. That's what I am going to fucking do. You know, Shut the fuck up and shoot. Shit. Happy now? Fuck with. Yeah, yeah it seems like they're trying way too hard to make this game cool by constantly swearing and make it mature for a, a game on the Wii. Guns, a doting sibling to a crippled brother, forced into a life of vice. Now she's filled with a primal hunger for revenge. Mankind's last hope now rests on the shoulders of two men. Caesar's heading to the hospital. We gotta stop that asshole before he gets there. Tasteful ride. Don't disrespect my wheels. She's my pride and joy. <laughs> Not anymore. Mm, we'll take my car. The plantation house has claimed its victims, but with Papa Caesar on the loose, nobody is safe. You died trying to stop Caesar. I won't rest until I've shot his fucking guts over half the county. Least of all, him. <laughs> Alright, so I guess that's the end of the first level. Uh, I'll, I think I'll probably just end the video here. Um, otherwise, the video will probably go on past a half hour or 40 minutes. I don't want to keep it too long. So, uh, Anyway, this has been my uh, video for House of Dead Overkill. As always, if you enjoyed what you watched, please make sure to like, comment, or subscribe. And I'll see you next time.